Yo guys, welcome to edition 15 of the 15 minutes hunt. So we're going to drive a brand new map once again for 15 minutes. Map is called It's a Dinosaur. Uh, really nice map name, dude. Um, let's have a look. 15 minutes timer on the right side as usually. Around 64 players on the server and top 10 will advance to the final this time. So let's see, let's get started. And let's uh, see where we have to go. I'm not sure if this was correct. I think it was. Alright, then let's see. Map looks good the first few turns. So, Mapper knows what he's doing, I guess. Okay. Let's see how long it is. Some poles. And here's the finish. So, around. Oops. <laughs> Barely made it. 33 seconds or something. At least a nice time by Arisal already. Ah, you can just go here, alright. Let's see. I, by the way, might move this cup to Fridays instead of Saturdays to avoid that two cups, cups place, uh, take place at the same time. Which is not that good if people want to take part in both. So I might change it to Fridays, but I can tell you already now that there will not be an edition next week because I'm on holiday, not at home. But in two weeks again, probably then. I'll just keep you updated on Trackmania Masters on Facebook and on their 15 Minutes Hunt uh, information page. But yeah. Let's focus on the map a bit now. I didn't really understand the ending yet, how to avoid hitting the border when you jump into the finish. Have to check that out. <clears throat> so... Okay, I keep hitting it. Never mind. Let's see. Don't really have a good line here at the start yet. But there's enough time left. Just going with little improvements here. So I guess uh, 32.5 or something might be the best time here in the 15 minutes. Right now we're out. We're at 33.10. Oh no, actually Harvey with the first 32 here in the 15 minutes on today. Uh, this part is interesting, where you land in the little bump there. Okay, you can avoid the wall at the end. Just had a look at that again. Not really happy with that start. On the bottom right side you can of course also see the current ranking which I have and as everyone else I'm aiming for top 10. Not sure what I have to, what I think about the map. Like the route was really clear, but then I'm struggling here. 
with the lines. <laughs> Arizal also has problems with the landing. How do you not hit? Yeah, it's really hard to not hit the wall. But I think you don't lose a lot of time if you hit. That star was better. Here you need a lot of speed. Okay, this this looks way bad. Oh my god! Straight into the pole. This part is a bit strange. Um, yeah. But how? I guess you have to jump very early here if you don't want to hit the wall. But then that happens what I just did. I'm gonna crash into the wall before. <clears throat> I think some people also have problems with this part here. At least Pex has. don't really have a good feeling on the map half of the time is over over yeah okay no speed beside that star was okay here is where I lost a lot of time Really tough turn. Okay, a bit more speed this time. Oh. Why did I jump there? And still better time. So yeah, lots of improvement possible for me here. Not like that. Let's see when I go for more speed. Okay. I guess I have to go for more speed. That paid off. Thanks. <clears throat> 21st right now. Let's see. 0.52 by Hobby. So just around the time I expected. But five minutes earlier already. God, what is this? K 
can't drive precise. No skills. Wow. Bump again. Please. And Kuba is getting the first. Slow down. Please. <laughs> Wasting so much time. Okay, people are unhappy with the map. Beside Papu. Potato map. <laughs> Damn comments. I I really don't know why I can drive that star precise. I mean, what the hell? Keyboard can't be an excuse. Last two minutes were a waste of time again. I hope you skipped that part. <laughs> wow. <laughs> What is happening with my car and that line rip? Nice time by Arizel, so he's easily in the top 10. Nice slowdown. Oops. Fail the end. Rip. That happens when you waste too much time at the beginning and you hardly drive the end just three or five times, three to five times maybe. For once a good start. Why do I jump there? Okay. Definitely not my map. Like here already. It's Okay, forget it. Let's have a look how they do it. 
So Aerosol Poker, Skillet, Kubais, Karahu, Logix, Habi, Scotsman, I think, uh, and Adri. And Zach are in. 10 seconds left. Let's see if something changes there in the top 10. Not so far. So yeah, those players are in the top 10. And let's skip over and start with the knockout final. All right, so here we go with the with nine rounds of a knockout final. And let's see where the players have problems. I hope they are all here. I guess they are now, there's no warm up. And yes, I think they are all starting. So let's see. Oh, <laughs> who was that? Already someone crashed heavily there. Hobby. Hobby is out, I guess. Full stopic. So, we can also have a look already at the other players. And we see how they do this part here. Wow! Is it Audrey? Yeah. I think it was Audrey. But Harvey is still very far behind all the other drivers, so no danger for them. Pork wins the round. And what? what? Audrey? <laughs> oh my god, I missed that because I was on Harvey, but Audrey? Wow. <laughs> Very funny first round. Oh my god, what did that guy do? <laughs> so Harvey is safe. Didn't expect that. But this is how it goes. He didn't give up. And Harvey is still in. So let's go with him. If he makes the start this time. Oh, Kuba is with the slowdown. But Harvey again with problems. Just like in the round before. And he's once again last. But Arizal crashes slightly. On the inside line had less speed now so let's see he's last right now but here comes the difficult part of the map and we see no crashes no mistakes and here we see three people and logix with the worst one but aerosol again oh my god <laughs> uh what poker what did you do <laughs> i think he missed the finish Oh my god. Like three people, I think Skillet, Aerosol, Logix crashed at the same turn and Poker at the end again. Against that wall. <laughs> uh, sorry for missing that again, but... Hard to call. But Poker is out. Let's go with Harvey again. He has once again the worst start. I think he doesn't really like the map. He doesn't know how to do the start well. Also, now he has no speed at all. But... Wow! And here goes Scotsman. Scotsman out, but... No! <laughs> Karu against the pole. Oh my god, I saw that this time. And another guy... Kubais? They both didn't make it. Kubais is in the back. <laughs> what is this map? Kubais into the finish on his back, oh my god. <laughs> they all have problems with the last jump. And Kuba is still ill. Oh my god. <laughs> really entertaining to uh, just watch this. Let's go on. Kuba is still in. Harvey still in. And let's go with him again. First time he got that start equal with the other players. So... See who's last right now. It's kind of close this time. I think it's Zack. Zack or Harvey. Harvey with less speed. Harvey should be last right now. But Kuwais drops down. Maybe a slowdown. Landmark. Skillet goes on oh, another guy into the pole. Logix. <laughs> but everyone, everyone made a uh, the finish this time. Wow. Yeah, lots of mistakes. That just shows the map. It's not really easy. And Logix is out. Oh. After going into the pole, six players left. So pretty hard map you build there, I would say. At least not that easy to get it consistent after just 15 minutes of time attack. Harvey again in last. Different lines here. If you had a look at Skillet, he was on the very right side. Well, almost went up to first, but no! And here goes Scotsman. 
But Skillet again. Let's see if Skillet makes it to the finish. No, he fails. And, <laughs> and Scotsman. Is it Scotsman? Yeah, it's Scotsman. <laughs> you say Skillet doesn't make it to the finish. Oh my god. Okay, Arizal, Zach, Kubais, Harvey, and Scotsman are still in. So, four more rounds on this map. No warm up once again. And. I think there was not even one round that uh, so far with no crash at all. Maybe this time. Let's get it started. This time on Scotsman. Scotsman with a good start. Goes up to first. Let's see where Kubais is. Kubais has more speed than Arizal here now. Can he overtake him here? Maybe, yes, looks good so far, but more airtime. Really difficult turn, he had more airtime and let's, let's see, do they all make it? Yes, they all make it and Kubais is out. Oh, that was actually the first round which was kind of close. And you saw the problem, Kubais had more speed, therefore he jumped further. Or just more to the left side as well and therefore Arizal had more speed again and Arizal overtook him again. So kind of an interesting map, but really hard for the players. Harvey goes up to last place again after having no speed. Goes down to last place, sorry. And here's the difficult part, they all make it kind of equal this time. Harvey gets closer to all the other players. Oh, that will be really close, Scotsman or Harvey, wow! <laughs> what, Zack? Zack ripped. <laughs> <laughs> on the very last jump. And actually Scotsman went up to first at that end. Really close round and just sag with a mistake. Two more rounds. And Harvey still in. After struggling so hard at the start. In the first few rounds. And Arizal crashes. Now it will be really hard for him to catch up. And no slide because he had less speed. Ooh. Now some really needs to fail the end big. Scotsman with the mistake, but it's not enough yet. Should be easy for Harvey to just finish without crashing. Let's see if they make it. Scotsman with an awkward line, maybe. No, he makes it. And Arisa. <laughs> Arisa. GG. Nice flight. And we will see now in the last round Harvey versus Scotsman. On this dramatic map, let's call it like that. It's a dinosaur by Storvix, German player. And let's see. Better start by Harvey this time. Who has more speed? Harvey has less speed, I think, but the better line. Here comes Scotsman with more speed. Equal so far. Some different lines again. Scotsman goes for more speed. But he crashes, he can't make it. So let's stay on Harvey. Harvey will just need to finish without crashing. And it looks good. He saves it. Yes, and Harvey wins this edition number 15. Congrats to him. And yeah, I think we saw some entertaining rounds there. Second place goes to Scotsman. GG. Alright, I want to keep that map rating short. You saw the problems I had and other players were not that happy either. Um, 5 out of 5 points for the map name at least, uh, but let's get started. Um, start was kind of okay, I just don't know why I really never got that good, but just my fail I guess. Anyway, first turn was alright, you easily, if you were too far on the inside, could have just drifted another time, then you made it. Um, next turn was also everything fine with that, just had to go for a lot of speed. Um, this was probably the most enjoyable turn on the track, I would say, where you could easily start to drift on that little edge here on the left side where it was uh, further down the road. Anyway, um, then we come up to the part here. It was not really good because you, the perfect line, or you may always end up here on the right side where you see the, the slides actually, and then you always uh, jumped slightly which made it really hard to get the drift for the next turn good. So problems with some problems with that. And here, mm, 
I think I know what you wanted to do, that people like jump here and land here between, like here where the shadow begins. But it didn't really work that good. It was really risky and if you had too much speed you jump too far and then you lost time again because of too much airtime. So I didn't really like that part. Um, next turn was alright again, nothing really to complain about that. It was hard though because uh, you know, I all found crashed here on the right side I think already. And next turn was also not easy because you came very far from the left side and you see uh, you can't go here already because there's an edge, you had to go more on the right side. So you had to adjust their line here, which was not that easy. Then between those poles that was alright. And then the ending was really really risky because you had once again, the perfect line would not be that you jump very early here on the right side, but later. And if you jump later, you... Uh, oh nice, my ghost is standing here. <laughs> but yeah, if you uh, jump too late, you always hit that uh, border and either you lost time or you made some nice uh, crashes like we saw in the last few rounds. So um, not a perfect map to be honest, I didn't really like it but it's always, of course, a bit of a matter of opinion. But I will just give it 2.5 out of 5 points. Anyway, thank you for submitting your map. And here are the best replays I collected from the last 15 minutes.